Press Statement Matthew Miller, Department Spokesperson May 30, 2024 The Department of State is publicly designating five current and former Ugandan officials for their involvement in significant corruption or gross violations of human rights. Speaker of Parliament Anita Among is designated due to involvement in significant corruption tied to her leadership of Uganda's parliament. Former Minister of Karamoha Affairs Mary Goretti Katutu, former Minister of State for Karamoha Affairs Agnes Nandutu, and Minister of State for Finance Amos Lugolobi are being designated due to their involvement in significant corruption related to conduct that misused public resources and diverted materials from Uganda's neediest communities. All four officials abused their public positions for their personal benefit at the expense of Ugandans. Additionally, Peter Elwalu, former Deputy Chief of the Ugandan People's Defense Forces, UPDF, is designated due to his involvement in gross violations of human rights. Specifically, Peter Elwalu was involved, while commanding UPDF forces, in extrajudicial killings that were committed by members of the UPDF. As a result of these actions, the designated Ugandan officials are generally ineligible for entry into the United States. The department is also taking steps to impose visa restrictions on multiple other Ugandan officials for undermining the democratic process and repressing members of marginalized or vulnerable populations in Uganda. These individuals are responsible for, or complicit in, the repression of Ugandan members of political opposition groups, civil society organizers, and vulnerable communities in Uganda. The United States stands with Ugandans advocating for democratic principles, a government that delivers for all its citizens, and accountability for actions committed by those who abuse their position through corruption and gross violations of human rights. Impunity allows corrupt officials to stay in power, slows the pace of development, facilitates crime, and causes unequal distribution of resources, which can affect underrepresented and underserved populations disproportionately. Today's actions reaffirm the U.S. commitment to support transparency in Uganda's democratic processes, counter corruption globally, and address the broader culture of impunity that prevents all Ugandans from enjoying their human rights and fundamental freedoms. These public designations are made under Section 7031C of the Department of State, Foreign Operations, and Related Programs Appropriations Act, 2024, Div. F. PL 118-47. The department is also designating among spouse, Moses Magago Hasim, Katutu's spouse, Michael George Katutu, and Lugolobi's spouse, Eveline Nakamara, they also are generally ineligible for entry into the United States. The additional steps to impose visa restrictions on multiple other Ugandan individuals are being taken under Section 212, A, 3, C, of the Immigration and Nationality Act under the Policy Secretary Blinken expanded in December 2023. TAGS. Bureau of African Affairs Bureau of Democracy, Human Rights, and Labor Human Rights. Office of the Spokesperson Uganda. White House USA.gov. Office of the Inspector General.